It's shipping day. channel y'all yeah, sure you know who is or you know who is the ceo by taste and i'm back with another video if you were new here be sure to hit that subscribe button turn on those notification bells hit the like button if you're not new welcome back make sure your bells are on and be sure to hit the like button and comment but y'all i am back with a day in my life video part one i packaged the order so if you haven't seen part one be sure to check part one out this part i basically was taking orders to the post office i went to the gym i went to walmart as y'all can see and now i am back home and i just wanted to show you guys the behind the scenes of me creating content as y'all know september 4th is approaching fastly my three-year business anniversary make sure you're signed up for emails make sure you're following you do not want to miss the blowout y'all the website will be discounted tremendously so um I just, I already started working on content. I recorded um, for my personal page. So if you're not following my personal Instagram, which is Rika underscore forever, if you have been following me, then you've noticed that I've been posting a lot more. I've been posting reels daily. So I was working on that content, Amazon Find content. content. So if you're interested in pink stuff, my Amazon links are in my link tree. Well, I do have my Amazon business owner link storefront link in my description box if you're interested in any of the business related items i get from amazon but if you're interested in all the pink stuff if you love pink all of that stuff is on my link tree and those can be found on my instagram either of my instagram pages so i'm just playing around with content y'all i'm about to come schedule some posts so i'm just gonna chat with you guys while i create content and let's see what topic should we talk about today I guess today's topic is going to be kind of like what I'm doing now is getting ahead and staying prepared. Um, I always speak on this on my channel. You want to work ahead. You want to be prepared. Like people ask me all the time, how are you able to go to school? How are you able to work a job and run three businesses? Because at one point in 2021, I was running three businesses. My lip gloss business, my boutique purse business, and my lash page. All the Instagrams, all the emails, three different websites. So people ask me all the time, how are you able to run all these businesses while work your job, while go to school, and also be a YouTuber in... The answer is time management. So that's what we're going to talk about while I work on content today is time management. Time management is so important, y'all. Like, when it, you can get things done. If you have kids, I don't have kids, so I can't speak on having kids. But I know kids are a lot from what I've seen, okay? But you can still get things done if you learn how to manage your time i'm gonna be working on things next year for my bris my business my brand y'all know that i dropped my manifestation journals last year the end of last year sold out within two months so i have so many things planned for that but i'm gonna wait for 2023 because this year i just have too much stuff going on i'm still trying to figure out things with my sprinter i'm still trying to um figure out things for my vending machine. I'm still trying to get this anniversary sale together, Black Friday, Christmas, everything is approaching, okay? So I'm trying to get all of this stuff out the way. And then while business kind of slows down is when I'm gonna work on newer things. So that way, you know, you don't wanna, that's another thing, you don't wanna like do things at once. One like tip I can give y'all or gem, I can give y'all tip gem, is you want to stretch things out. So say for example, if you wanna drop a new release clothing item or a new new releases you want to spread them out you don't just want to drop 10 pieces at one time you want to try to drop two pieces a week because if you sit here and drop 10 clothing items one day what's gonna happen next week what's gonna happen a week after and you have to keep customers engaged like 
If you want people to continue to come back to your website, to continue to shop over and over again, you have to constantly think of new things, new way. Y'all, I don't even know where I'm looking. <laughs> Honestly, this is my new camera. I hope I'm looking in the right spot. If I'm not, y'all, I apologize. But you want to keep people engaged. You don't want to just drop all this stuff and then it's like you're constantly promoting the same stuff over and over again. So that's like when I say with my new arrival items, I'm not dropping those until next year. I already have so much going on in my business and I know like business owners know once Black Friday's over with, once Christmas is over with, business slows down no matter what business you're in. When I used to work at JCPenney's retail, once Christmas and New Year's hits, you're barely getting any hours. The store is completely empty. The store literally goes from all these people coming in all day, every day, long lines to literally nobody on the line. Okay, if you've ever worked retail, then you know how that goes. And that's the same thing with being an e-commerce business. Once holiday season is over, people are not going to be shopping as much as they used to or they were shopping. So you need to figure out and strategize, okay, what can I do to keep people, you know, coming back to my business page or focused on my business what can I do and that's where my new stuff I'll be working on will come in okay but in the meantime y'all let, let, let's get to this content okay let's get to this content so I take all of my content off of my iPhone this case was sent to me I'm gonna tag the person that sent me this phone case by the way it's super super cute but um, I'm just about to take a whole bunch of different styles of pictures for my business. All of my pictures are taken off of my phone. And if you want to see the end result of these pictures, then you can check out my Instagram page. It will be posted on my Instagram page because I'm about to schedule these posts out. But I'm just taking, you know, different... I'm just playing around y'all taking different varieties of pictures. Um, what else was I going to say? Because I, whether I, y'all, engagement has been trash lately, but one thing about me, I'm going to always be consistent. Whether I get likes or not on my posts, I'm going to still post regardless, okay? I don't focus on the numbers. So if you haven't seen my motivational video, you definitely want to check that out. The video to stay motivated because that pretty much is where I'm at. And if you're at that place, be sure to watch that video because... You don't want to be focused on the numbers because it's so easy to get caught on like, wow, I posted this picture and I, I'm not getting no likes. I'm not getting this. I'm not getting that. You don't want to get yourself caught up in that because that's when you start to lose motivation. That's when you start to feel down. That's when you start to feel all types of stuff. So I'm also going to post boomerangs on my Instagram at this moment. So if you do follow my business page, then you probably have already seen me post this because I'm posting it in real time. But the pictures I'm not going to post until like I'm scheduling my post out. So like I said, when I take my product pictures, y'all, I take my product pictures on my, ooh, on my iPhone camera. This is not the newest iPhone. This one... It's not the newest one. It's a generation back. I don't even remember which one I have. And then I have my ring light. My ring light is linked in my business Amazon must-haves in the description box. So I'm slowly stocking up while organizing. But we were talking about um, how to stay consistent, how to manage your time. One way that I manage my time is by making a to-do list every single day. Before I go to bed, I make my to-do list. And if I don't make it before I go to bed, I do it first thing when I wake up. But I find it more beneficial when you make your to-do list before you go to bed. Because that way you already wake up knowing, you know, what your agenda is for the day. Like today, for example, I had to finish packing orders. I had to go to the post office. I had to go to the gym. I had to go to Walmart. And I had to record content. So all of that was on my to-do list. And I'm getting everything has been completed. And... I recorded, edited, and uploaded a video. So I ended up doing more than was on my to-do list. Which is crazy because I did get up a little late today. Because um, every time I take my allergy medicine, I can never wake up on time. But I still got everything done, y'all. And it's only 6.35. So it's not going to take me long to take these content like pictures. What's going to take me long is trying to watermark everything. And it's honestly sad that we have to even watermark our stuff y'all but the way these people be stealing pictures 
I mean, they, they steal the pictures with the watermark. I mean, it's crazy. But what's going to take me time is actually watermarking all of my pictures and then captioning them and um, making like the posts for them. But I can do all of that like, you know, laying in bed. I don't have to necessarily do that right now. Right now, I'm just getting that out the way so I don't even have to be here when I am watermarking and that's another thing like when people say how do you do things when you work this is what I do I'll spend 30 minutes an hour just taking all different varieties of pictures and videos saving all of them to my phone so that way even if I'm on my lunch break at work I can watermark my pictures I can edit my pictures I can post even when I'm not home I will have content to post and it'll look like I'm at home so I'm going to take some lip gloss pictures. I don't know if I want to swatch this one. I do have my swatch one right here. This one is Aurora Crystal. And if you did not know, if there's anybody new here, I do sell lashes and lip gloss wholesale. Over 35 lash options. Please check out my website. Super fast shipping. But y'all, September 4th, September 4th, September 4th. Y'all gonna be sick of me. I feel like every year, <laughs> all I speak on is September 4th, September 4th, September 4th. Like, that's, that's really all we speak on. So I'm gonna take some pictures like this. And then I think I'm gonna take some... Y'all could probably barely see it, y'all. Because I, I got a screen for the privacy screen. But I want to do one with a swatch of it. But then I feel like once I put the swatch on, I'm not going to really be able to take other pictures because I'm going to have to clean it off. So I'm not going to do a swatch today. I'm just going to take a bunch of, like I said, different varieties. Just different varieties of pictures. So I could do like a carousel post. So I'm just going to do different varieties and try to focus it on the product. Okay, yeah, so those are good. I just got to... Oh my gosh, y'all, somebody just booked a business evaluation with me. Somebody just booked a business evaluation. She booked it for August 28th. A, 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 A. Y'all, if y'all did not know, I do have business evaluations available on my website. So if you need business help and you would love to talk to me one-on-one, -on -one, be sure to check out my website and book. Okay, what else am I gonna what what else am I gonna post? I probably should post um some eyeliner pictures because I haven't posted these in a minute. So I probably do a mix of these. Y'all, this is literally how I take my pictures. I just be grabbing stuff and thinking of stuff and, and trying to be creative. Like I just be like, hmm, I should I should do a picture like this. Hmm, I should do a picture like that. So I just wanted to show you guys. I do have a detailed video where I show you guys like once a product comes in, how I take a picture. So be sure to check those videos out, y'all. All of these videos that I have, I have plenty, okay? When it comes to how to stay motivated, when it comes to business tips and how to stay organized, I have several videos on that. Like I said, when it comes to taking product pictures, I have a whole detailed video that I recorded right when I came from work. At the time I recorded that video, I was still working my full-time job. And I literally showed y'all a whole bunch of different content variations, how I take pictures when it comes to unboxing pictures, everything. I have an entire video on that, y'all. But this video is kind of like live in action. Y'all are just watching how I take my product pictures. Like... You don't need any expensive, you don't need to have an expensive background, you don't need to have an expensive camera. You can literally work on content, take pictures, whatever you need to do with what you have, okay? This is how my inventory is normally organized, okay? This is how I pack orders, this is nothing special, just a, a, a storage shelf from Ikea, 
my inventory on it and I'm just using that as my background. I didn't spend hundreds of dollars on something. None of that, okay? So I'm just trying to figure out how I want to hold these. That's the thing. I'm just trying to see how I want to hold the pens to where it looks cute, I guess, y'all. I want it to look, like, cute. And this is also going to be a thumbnail picture. I'm trying to space it out together. Okay, that looks good. So I got me some liner pictures. Next, I'm going to take me some. Really, y'all, I'm just taking content pictures of everything, honestly. At this point, we just taking pictures of everything. We just taking pictures of every single item. And that way we have things to post. Because I'm about to schedule all of these posts out. It's this rubber band for me. Oops. And I love that my nails are freshly done. <laughs> freshly done nails, y'all. And then I'm going to take a picture with the rubber band pack. Because I do sell lash glue for wholesale. Okay, bam. Lash applicators. I don't know how I'm going to take that picture. Because I don't really want to take it out the pack. But I feel like it's hard to see it. Yeah, I'm going to have to figure out how exactly I want to take these lash applicator pictures. But for the mascara, I am going to take a picture of the box. And I'm going to take one out again so they know what that is. But as I was saying, y'all, a to-do list helps tremendously when it comes to, um, when it comes to staying organized, I make my to-do list every night. You don't need anything fancy to create a to-do list. You can do it off of your phone. I make my to-do list on my notes in my iPhone. I also have a notepad, which I'm not sure where it is. I also have, well, I have several things, y'all. I have journals i have a actual notepad that has a to-do list weekly and then i have digital ebooks that i've purchased from other business owners that i do a digital and that kind of helps me when it comes to my um what is that what am i trying to say that kind of helps me for when it comes to my my content creating like Writing things down helps me tremendously because I will literally forget. I'll sit here and be like, dang, I was supposed to do something today. I was supposed to record this. But when I content make a content creating list, and that's why I said y'all stay tuned for all the stuff I have planned coming next year. Because I will have a lot of stuff like centered on content creating specifically like because this is something that I actually do hardcore. Like, everybody always tells me, I love your content. I love your content. People that have been following me, they love my content. People follow me for my content. So, when I drop my content creating stuff, I hope these same people come through and copy. Okay? I, I hope they do. So, what am I going to take pictures of now? So, let me see. I got pictures of the liner pens. I got pictures of the lashes. Magnetic, I did take some pictures off of live already. Y'all, so I think I'm going to stop here and I'm going to go watermark all of these pictures because I want to have all of this stuff scheduled tonight, y'all. And the video that I'm recording right now, I want to have this edited up on my channel ready to go. I want these videos, not these videos, but these pictures 
watermarked and ready to go because like I said it's about to get busy for me my business anniversary is literally next weekend and I'm gonna be busy all of next week so that's why it's very important I, and I mean I got a lot of stuff done today this will pretty much last me until next week because when it comes my business anniversary is on Sunday I just need enough content to get me through till like Thursday ish because once Friday hits September 1st or 2nd I will be closing the website completely my new website is already done it's ready to go I just gotta switch it and publish the new one so once September 1st second hits my website will be closed I'm not sure when exactly this video will be up but it will be up before the anniversary sale but my website will be closed and at that point I will be telling everybody what the prices is, is on everything everything will be on discount y'all y'all do not want to miss this sale there's a lot of stuff that i need gone like gone gone so i'm discounted cheaper way cheaper than it actually costs so you don't want to miss it okay so i will be posting like then i'll be straight on focusing on content like i'll be recording as i go but as of right now i just need like content to get me through like as far as posting consistently every single day i need content to get me through to late next week and i feel like i have enough i took a lot of pictures today i also use pink content posts as well so that in addition to all the pictures i took today can help pretty much last me to next week and the next week it will pretty much be focused on what i have in stock because of course by next week i may not have all of this stuff here i might still have it i might not so we're gonna do new content okay so i hope y'all enjoyed this video a little behind the scenes and chat be sure to turn your notification bells on so you don't miss my other uploads if you have not watched my recent videos be sure to check those out like i said i have more in-depth videos when it comes to content creating when it comes to how to stay consistent when it comes to being productive i have videos on all of that stuff be sure to leave a comment if you watch this video all the way to this point comment lashes so for this video you're gonna comment lashes and that's how i'll know you watch this video all the way through thank y'all for the support i will see y'all on the next